Um, yeah, we you know we were eight points in front. You know, with strong breeze behind us in the second half. You know, ideally we would have liked to have kicked on from there. Um, you know, credit to Connacht, they came back strong. You know, they were in the game the whole time, so um, we couldn't quite shake them up. But you know, it was good good spirit from the guys at the end. You know, f you know to hold Connacht out. Um, but yeah, we 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 made life quite difficult for ourselves during the course of the game. I thought I'd rather we, <laughs> when we're eight points in front, I'd rather we go to 15 points in front and just push on and um, get out of sight. But uh, you know, a lot of credit to Connacht as well. You know, they're I think they've been they're a very cohesive team um, in terms of you know very similar selections. You know, they, a lot of confidence from their big wins against Breve in Europe. You know, I thought they were outstanding against Ulster. Will they? Pretty much dismantled them, um, very destroyed them up front in the set piece, and uh, were very good and efficient playing off quick ball as a result of that. So um, yeah, it was it was a tough t tough challenge for us today. Um, yeah, we're, we're a little bit disappointed the fact that we didn't push on. We were, as I said, eight points in front, but you know it's a win for us, another four points, and we don't have to wait long till our next uh, game here. So um, it'll be a quick turnaround. Watch the. Monster Ulster game now, um, and you know, see what we can get out of that, and obviously try and prepare as well as we possibly can in quite a short period of time.